let's see how we can debug our applications using adb in kiwi python so adb stands for android development bridge that lets you perform various tasks uh, such as installing apks and debugging those apks in this lecture we will learn how we can use adb for debugging processes but first of all we need adb one way is to go to the official website of android and download the command line tools and using these command line tools further install the android adb and it's quite a long process instead just go to this website which is android sdk manager dot azure websites dot net and there you will find the android platform tools so just download 30.0.2 version and depending on your operating system if you are using linux then click on this link mac for this and we are using windows so let's click here after downloading this platform tools just extract it and after extracting them you will see something like this we have some files and here as you can see we have our adb in order to use this adb first of all we need to enable the developer option on our smartphone so that we could use our smartphones for debugging in order to enable the debugging mode on your smartphone uh, just go to the settings and the interface might be different if you are using another version of android just go to the bottom menu of the settings click on about phone go to the software info and just tap on build number several times and this will enable the developer mode go back one more time and now you will see the developer option just click on this developer option go to the bottom and you will see usb debugging so let's enable the usb debugging okay so we have successfully enabled our usb debugging on the smartphone and it's time to use the adb on the smartphone so in order to use the adb we need to open the command prompt here you can also use the powershell but we will stick with the command prompt just open command prompt right here for now let's see how many devices are connected with this pc in debugging mode adb devices and currently we have one attached device so let's see how to debug for debugging process uh, you need to type adb again dash s the minus sign and then the id of the device so if you have multiple devices attached you will see those devices uh, let's copy this id put it in double quotes and we are going to use the log cat which allow us to debug our apps log cat we need to focus on some specific logs and these are python logs for this purpose we need to use a filter and that will be find str and i forward slash python with a small p let's hit enter and now this adb or logcat will listen to the activities on our smartphone it's time to open our app on the smartphone and see what we will get on this screen so i have just opened the smartphone and here as you can see we are getting bunch of messages and all of these messages starts from this i slash python string and here as you can see we have successfully connected with the database so you are going to see all of your print statements which you have used in the app right here let's log in and if your app is crashing then you will also see why your app is crashing on your smartphone right here which will help you in solving the issue login successful and everything is working fine let's quit the app and here as you can see we got our messages login successful and leaving the app is in progress finally our app has been ended this is how you can use the logcat in kiwi
so i hope you have understood it and in the next video we are going to see something new and i'll see you there bye bye